The five ETFs we will explain today are IHI, QID, TZA, SDS, ARKF. Please note that this analysis is based on the latest data and is subject to change. Investors should always do their own research before making any investment decisions. What technical signals should you watch for when analyzing IHI? Technical Signals and Analysis IHI's 14-Day Relative Strength Index, RSI, value was 54. When the RSI is between 50 and 70, it generally indicates that the stock is moderately bullish. This means that the securities price has been rising but has not yet reached overbought levels, which are usually considered an RSI reading of 75 or higher. The current stochastic oscillator of IHI is 66%. When the stochastic oscillator stays between 50 and 80, it may indicate that the stock is experiencing a mild downtrend with some selling pressure. In this case, an oversold signal could indicate that a stock is reaching a potential buying opportunity. Trend Outlook IHI has a 40% probability of rising stock price. When the probability of rising is lower than 50%, it means that the probability of falling is relatively high. If the probability of rising is higher than 50%, it means that the probability of stock rising is relatively high. Combining multiple technical analysis indicators, IHI has four bullish signals and two bearish signals. IHI's short-term support level is 55.6. If it falls below 55.6 during the session, it will have a chance to test 54.8. IHI's short-term resistance level is 56.9. If it breaks through 56.9 during the session, it will look up to 58. What technical factors should you consider when analyzing QID? Technical Signals and Analysis QID's 14-day relative strength index, RSI, value, was 55. When the RSI is between 50 and 70, it generally indicates that the stock is moderately bullish. This means that the securities price has been rising but has not yet reached overbought levels, which are usually considered an RSI reading of 75 or higher. The current stochastic oscillator of QID is 5%. When the indicator falls below the 20 level, it is usually considered oversold, indicating that a price rebound or recovery is likely for the stock. An oversold condition occurs when the stock price falls too fast and too much in a short period of time, which may indicate that the selling pressure has exhausted. Trend Outlook QID has a 42% probability of rising stock price. When the probability of rising is lower than 50%, it means that the probability of falling is relatively high. If the probability of rising is higher than 50%, it means that the probability of stock rising is relatively high. Combining multiple technical analysis indicators, QID has five bullish signals and three bearish signals. QID's short-term support level is 37. If it falls below 37 during the session, it will have a chance to test 36.3. QID's short-term resistance level is 40.2. If it breaks through 40.2 during the session, it will look up to 41.8. What technical factors drive TZA performance? Technical Signals and Analysis TZA's 14-Day Relative Strength Index, RSI, value was 34. When the RSI is above 25 and below 50, it generally indicates that the stock is moderately bearish. 
This means that the securities price has been falling but has not yet reached oversold levels, typically considered an RSI reading of 25 or lower. The current stochastic oscillator of TZA is 6%. When the indicator falls below the 20 level, it is usually considered oversold, indicating that a price rebound or recovery is likely for the stock. An oversold condition occurs when the stock price falls too fast and too much in a short period of time, which may indicate that the selling pressure has exhausted. Trend Outlook The probability of TZA share price rising is 59%. When the probability of rising is higher than 50%, it means that the stock has a higher chance of rising. If the probability of rising is lower than 50%, it means that the probability of falling is high. Combining multiple technical analysis indicators, TZA has three bullish signals and four bearish signals. TZA's short-term support level is 13.7. If it falls below 13.7 during the session, it will have a chance to test 11.2. TZA's short-term resistance level is 17. If it breaks through 17 during the session, it will look up to 18.8. .8. What technical factors drive SDS performance? Technical signals and analysis. SDS's 14-Day Relative Strength Index, RSI, value was 50 when the RSI is above 25 and below 50, it generally indicates that the stock is moderately bearish. This means that the securities price has been falling but has not yet reached oversold levels, typically considered an RSI reading of 25 or lower. The current stochastic oscillator of SDS is 5%. When the indicator falls below the 20 level, it is usually considered oversold, indicating that a price rebound or recovery is likely for the stock. An oversold condition occurs when the stock price falls too fast and too much in a short period of time, which may indicate that the selling pressure has exhausted. Trend Outlook SDS has a 40% probability of rising stock price. When the probability of rising is lower than 50%, it means that the probability of falling is relatively high. If the probability of rising is higher than 50%, it means that the probability of stock rising is relatively high. Combining multiple technical analysis indicators SDS has four bullish signals and four bearish signals. SDS's short-term support level is 22.1. If it falls below 22.1 during the session, it will have a chance to test 21.9. SDS's short-term resistance level is 23.4. If it breaks through 23.4 during the session, it will look up to 23.7. Has ARKF experienced bullish or bearish technical momentum recently? Technical Signals and Analysis ARKF's 14-Day Relative Strength Index, RSI, value, was 56. When the RSI is between 50 and 70, it generally indicates that the stock is moderately bullish. This means that the securities price has been rising but has not yet reached overbought levels, which are usually considered an RSI reading of 75 or higher. The current stochastic oscillator of ARKF is 83%. When the stochastic oscillator rises above the 80 level, it is usually considered overbought indicating that the stock may be due for a price pullback or pullback. An overbought condition occurs when a stock's price rises too fast and too high in a short period of time and can be a sign that buying pressure has exhausted. Trend Outlook 
The probability of a RKF share price rising is 52%. When the probability of rising is higher than 50%, it means that the stock has a higher chance of rising. If the probability of rising is lower than 50%, it means that the probability of falling is high. Combining multiple technical analysis indicators, ARKF has four bullish signals and two bearish signals. ARKF short-term support level is 27.8. If it falls below 27.8 during the session, it will have a chance to test 27.4. ARKF short-term resistance level is 29.3. If it breaks through 29.3 during the session, it will look up to 30.